Ferritin Test This test is performed to determine your body's total iron storage capacity and when your healthcare practitioner suspects that you may have too little iron, iron deficiency, or too much iron, iron overload in the body. Ferritin is a protein that contains iron and is the primary form of iron stored inside of cells. The small amount of ferritin that is released and circulates in the blood is a reflection of the total amount of iron stored in the body. In healthy people, most of the iron absorbed by the body is incorporated into the hemoglobin of red blood cells. Most of the remaining is stored as ferritin or as hemosiderin or other substances. When the level of iron is insufficient to meet the body's needs, iron stores are depleted and ferritin levels decrease. This may occur because of not enough iron is consumed, the body is unable to absorb iron from the foods eaten. There is an increased need for iron, such as during pregnancy or childhood, or due to a condition that causes chronic blood loss. Conversely, iron storage and ferritin levels increase when more iron is absorbed than the body needs. This can lead to the progressive buildup of iron compounds in organs and may eventually cause their dysfunction and failure. The sample required is a blood sample drawn from a vein in your arm. In the early stage of iron deficiency, no physical effects are usually seen. However, as the iron deficiency progresses, the most common symptoms of iron deficiency anemia begin to appear, such as fatigue, weakness, dizziness, headaches, pale skin. However, signs and symptoms of iron overload occur due to iron accumulation in the blood and tissues. They may include joint pain, fatigue, weakness, weight loss, lack of energy, loss of sex drive, organ damage, such as in the heart and liver. Normally, most ferritin is found inside of cells with only a small amount in blood. However, ferritin levels can become elevated when an organ contains much ferritin is damaged, such as the liver, spleen, or bone marrow, even though the total amount of iron in the body is normal. Al Borg Medical Laboratories. Watch more at our YouTube channel.